Tragic news, heartbreaking to hear a young promising doctor, Shahana from Kerala, 26 year old who was studying post graduation at the Kerala Medical Association, who claimed her own life after an anesthesia overdose because the family that had approached her family for a marriage proposal demanded dowry to the tune of a 15 acre land, BMW car, and 150 sovereign gold. Of course, Shahana's family was shocked. They were already fairly involved. Ruiz, the boy, the man's name, and Shahana, they were talking for a few months. And then Ruiz decided, because Shahana's family could not pay up, he severed all ties. So he cut away from her. That led to her depression, and she killed herself. Unfortunately, what we're shocked here is that in the 21st century, we still, still see the evils of dowry that persist. 7,000 dowry-related deaths that happen every year in India, the highest coming from UP, Bihar, Madhya Pradesh. As we see here, uh, there's a, as per a survey, basically, the shocking part here is that the more the boy earns, the more the family asks for dowry. Ruiz, he himself is a doctor and studying post-graduation with the Kerala Medical Association. And uh, there was really no reason for the family to ask for dowry because considering they were fairly uh, well settled. But unfortunately, this is a trend and pattern that we're seeing in India as per the survey that uh, the better quality groom, more educated in a better post, the more dowry that they demand. The only conclusion as per that survey is that the more number of women who are educated and enter the workforce, this menace is likely to end sooner or later. Tragic news, heartbreaking.